What's going on, Poke people? Poke Dash in here, back with another video. How are you guys doing today? I am doing great. I am super excited. We've got a big one lined up today. Um, talking about this V Star Universe. Uh, this is a huge set. Huge set. For those unfamiliar, it's basically a wrap up of the Sword and Shield era. Um, it's got a lot of, I think it's got a lot of like full arts, V maxes, Vs, all from, you know, different series throughout the Sword and Shield era. It's also got uh, a bunch of new and original cards uh, peppered in as well. So it's a very big set. Uh, really looking forward to opening this one. In other news, I am going to be switching up my posting schedule starting with the new years. I don't know if you know, you've seen the post about it that I posted earlier in the month, but I'm going to be switching from a Tuesday, Friday schedule to a Wednesday, Saturday schedule. Just works a lot easier with my work schedule, along with when I, new releases come out from Pokemon, they generally drop on a Friday. So I would be able to get, you know, the new set, record, edit, and release it Saturday. So it just works out time-wise better that way too. Um... But that should be enough rambling from me. I'm not gonna hold uh, hold this up any longer. Let's get to ripping. I will catch you on the other side. I have been dying to get my hands on this set. I actually didn't think that I would be able to get this video out until later this month um, due to shipping times from Japan. Uh, but I am super glad that I opted to buy from a seller in Japan and not support the scalping in the US because I've seen these packs going for like anywhere between $140 to $200 and that is just insane. I bought both of these from a Japanese retailer and it was, I think if you bought one it was $92 but if you bought two it dropped it down to $82 each. So. Guys, it pays to be patient uh, and to shop around. Uh, it's just the cover art, I believe, on both sides, the pack art, yep. And I think that this comes with 10 packs each, maybe more. But I'm, no, I'm pretty sure it's 10 packs, uh, and each pack has 10 cards. Uh, there are a ton of alternate arts that are just insane. Uh, there's the gold, the uh, gold cards, I think it's Origin Form, Palkia and Dialga, uh, Arceus and Eternatus, I think, are the four with the gold cards, um, but also this set is like 280, so I'm not even going to list uh, chase cards, because that's, that's just too many, we'll be here all day. Um, there is, there's also a set... I think it's nine cards that you can only pull out of the God Pack, so that's pretty crazy. Um, and I'm hoping, you know, in the US set, we start seeing some of this, uh, like the cool features of like the Japanese set translate over to the English set. I know that they are starting to, uh, they're doing away with the yellow border cards starting in Scarlet and Violet, and they're also getting away the or getting rid of like the non holo rare. So that's cool. I've been a big fan of the Japanese uh, silver borders for a long time. Uh, I just think it's such a cleaner look. And honestly, when you look at like, when you look at the trainer galleries, right? Like the Japanese versions look so much cleaner with that sil silver border. Um, I, I don't know. It feels a little bit like a little less special <laughs> when you get it in English and it's like this crazy artwork and it's a full you know full art of or a full card of art and then there's just like this yellow border I am gonna miss the iconic yellow you know of course because that's it's vintage Pokemon man uh, and that's what I grew up with it's insane but yeah so looking forward to the Scarlet and Violet uh, when that drops all the changes Look at that, Origin Form Dialga. I actually have this in English, so that's gonna look really cool. Um, I believe, oh yeah, I 
there's these cool holographic uh, energy cards that have texture and stuff too. It's insane. The set is insane. This is, I honestly, I think that it's almost as, uh, almost as good as, not better than VMAX Climax. I am so excited. I think that there is a card trick, but I'm not sure. Oh, sh look at that. Toxtricity, full art. Oh, another uh, Dialga. Look at that. That is gorgeous. That is insane. Look at the colors on that. The blues and yellows mixing with the green. Oh, the purple. Oh, wow. That is incredible. Uh, you're also gonna have to give me a oh i didn't even notice that there's uh the ditto hollow i think that this is a new card for this set uh it's crazy cool crazy cool but yeah um with how big this set is and how many pokemon are included you're gonna have to forgive me i'm gonna make some mistakes and not know some of the names of the new regeneration pokemon so cut me a little slack on this video please I think, and the Drapion behind it, Regidrago, okay, cool, 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 Galarian Moltres, That looks like it's the hollow. Usually the Japanese sets do like a special kind of hollow. That's cool. That is incredible. Leafeon. That's amazing. V Star. I think that I have this one in English, so that's gonna look incredible right next to it. Look at that, the regular Kanto Moltres. It's incredible. Straight up not having a good time with the camera today. The Mew, yo, that's insane. Gorgeous. The Radiant Charizard? No way. Yo, that is insane. Holy, it's got the texture. Oh, wow. Wow. Yo, that is a big pull in my opinion. I haven't looked up any of the costs of the cards yet. Um, so yeah, but to me, I've been wanting to pull a Radiant Charizard uh, for a minute and I'm so stoked on that. The Giratina. Oh, I think that that's what the other golden card is. It's not the Eternal Dust, I think it's the Giratina. Suian Growlithe. Look at these though. These are crazy. Hollows, dude. The hollows are insane. Yo. Can't even tell what is that? Deoxys? I think that that's what it is. That is insane. It is what it is. Oh, Entei. Is it Entei or Entei? Dude, yo, dude, these artworks are insane. I know, I know I've seen like the Lucario, but this, oh my god, dude. The 
Arceus, yo, that's sick. V Star action. Galarian Zapdos. Lapras. Oh man, this is one of the best OG Pokemon. This is like, if you didn't know what Pokemon were, and somebody told you, like explained it to you, this is exactly what you would think of. <laughs> if that makes sense. Oh man. Yo, whoa. Oh wow. Woo. another huge card i think the deoxys forgive me i'm gonna check real quick but oh man that is off oh, the lapras and that the rcs v take it take it for sure Another Arceus, all right. Yo, the Mew. That is a gorgeous card. Oh, the Radiant. I don't know what this one is. What is that? It's Radiant, for sure. Let me look this up real quick. A few moments later. Charge a bug? All right, well, we'll take it. Oh, also, uh, there's a new Gengar card in this that looks insanely cool. Yo, Zorark. Another Mew. We'll take it, absolutely. All right, Zorora, my bad. No idea what this Pokemon is. That is a sick artwork. Another Ditto. And another Energy. That's sick. Incredible. And I'm just looking at these, these card lists. Like, the artworks are insane. There's so many. This is a huge set. This is a monster set. Genesect, I believe. Can't see that through the lens. Oh, the Glarian Articuno. Glarian Zapdos. Sweet. Yo, the Electivire and uh, what is it? The Magmar? Oh, wow. Holy, I'm gonna have to take a look at that. Is that the uh, Zorark? Oof. Yeah, that is actually insane. Look at that. I'm trying to find it on the list real quick to confirm because I am terrible with these newer names. But yeah, Zorark. Look at the texture this bad boy too holy dude this set packs some heat the charizard v star yo that is gorgeous i actually i do have this too in english so this is gonna look incredible right next to it yo wow Love that Magmar artwork. Oh, the Magma Zone. The 
another Galarian Moltres. Deoxys, and is that Toxicroak? I can't see through the lens. Yep. Or not Toxicroak, uh, Toxicity. Machamp. I have this in English too, I believe. This is, that's gonna look incredible. You got, oh my God, I love Machamp. Holy. This set, dude. This is insane. I'm definitely, definitely gonna be buying more and opening it on the channel, cause holy. All right, the Hisuian Voltorb and a trainer. Which trainer is that though? Latios, Ultra Ball. Let me look up what trainer this is. Full art. That's that's incredible. A little longer than a few minutes later. Colrus's experiment. All right. You know it's got texture and everything. That's take it, man. Holy crap! This stack of hits. Y'all, holy twenty packs. Uh. And we got a fast stack of hits. That is, that's insane. This is, I'm actually a little bit speechless, honestly. This was so much fun. If you were on the fence about buying this set, I hope that this pushes you over the edge into you actually buying it because this is, I don't regret this at all. I've got a birthday coming up in a couple weeks. I'm definitely gonna, cut. I think I'm gonna, this is gonna be my birthday present to myself because this is, Wow. Um, and I know that some of these cards probably may not be considered hits, but to me, they definitely are. Like this Mew. I love this Mew. We got our Radiant. I can't remember the name of this. It was something Bug, I feel like. Charbug? Shall, shall bug? Something? Uh, the Radiant Charizard. Look at that. That is insane. Uh, our Hisuian Voltorb. The Galarian Moltres, Genesect. Still don't know what this Pokemon is either, but this artwork is incredible. Look at that. Kind of looks like the alien from uh, Independence Day. Welcome to Earth. Uh, RCS. Another RCS. Uh, the Mew V. The Entei, Galarian Moltres, uh, Drapion, uh, Dialga, and we're getting into the trainer galleries or the character arts, I believe they're called. In uh, yeah, we got the Magnezone, the I believe it's Electivire and uh, Magmortar. The Lapras, which I am so hyped on this one. I am really hyped on this one. I love Lapras, and I feel like Lapras does not get enough love. So, super stoked on that one. Uh, the Deoxys Full Art, I think, or the character. Incredible. Uh, Thievil. The Toxtricities. Oh, look, I didn't even notice the little Rillaboom. Rillaboom in the back. Uh, the Machamp VMAX. I love this card. Um, I just pulled it in English not too long ago. Well, I didn't really pull it. It was in the uh, uh, the mystery packs. And we got our Charizard V-Star, which I have in English. I'm so excited to put this next to it. Um, also, I don't know if they do this in the English set, but these V-Stars all have like a hell of a lot of texture on them. It's insane. Uh, the Zorora, the Giratina, the Arceus, the Leafeon, another one that I'm super excited on. I know it's not like the biggest pull, 
but I do love me some evolutions, and I ha the fact that I have this in English just makes it all the better. Uh, Dialga, the metal type energy, the fighting energy. Uh, I can't remember the name of this one. I actually have it pulled up. Colress's experiment. Um, the Zorark alternate art V star, which is insane. And then the Deoxys alternate art V star, another insane one. All right, you guys. Well, that's gonna do it for another video. Um, that was insane. That was literally insane. Uh, I'm speechless. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys thought about it. Uh, let me know if you want me to open more on the channel. I would 100% be so down for that, buying a few more boxes. Maybe once uh, Crown Zenith releases, we could do like two of these boost or yeah, these two booster boxes and then like two uh, elite trainer boxes and see which one comes out on top or something. I don't know. I'm definitely down to film more of this though because this is an insane set. Uh, all right, well, if you like the video, please like the video. If you dislike it, leave a dislike. If you're new around here and you like the content or if you find yourself returning to the videos and liking what you're seeing, please hit that subscribe button. That's gonna do it for me today, guys. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'm gonna get on with my day. Take care, I'm out.